Music City Wrestling. You have insulted my intelligence. I've got Shane Eaton after me. Now I've got Burt Prentice after me. Burt Prentice, don't ever climb in the ring unless you want to get attacked. Just because I choked you, now you're trying to choke Princess D. Well, Burt Prentice, it's not going to happen in Nashville tonight. You're saying some kind of big Burt surprise. Well, you know what, Burt Prentice, Music City Wrestling? I don't really care about your big surprise. I'm majorly upset now, not only with Shane Eaton, but I'm upset with you, Burt Prentice, because you're not man enough to tell me who you're going to put in the square circle against Princess D tonight. Well, Burt Prentice, you must not know my reputation because I've been known to clean house with a very, very lot of pro professional women wrestlers. So whoever you get out of your closet, you better make sure that they know exactly what they're doing when they climb in the ring with this one. Because when I get in that ring, Burt Prentice, Music City Wrestling, and all them scumbags out there at the fairgrounds, I guarantee you, Burt Prentice, I'm going to take whoever it is. I don't care who it is. I don't care if it's Malia Hosaka. I don't care if it's Medusa. I don't care if it's Sherry Martell. I don't even care if it's you, Burt Prentice, because I'm going to do some business, and I'm going to do it bad, because I'm going to take somebody out tonight, because nobody double-crosses me, and that's a promise from Princess D to you, Burt Prentice, and that's a solemn vow. So tonight in Nashville, Tennessee, whoever you have, you can kiss them goodbye before they make it to the ring because you're not going to see them afterwards because I'm giving my promise that it's going to be over tonight and then I'm going to demand your respect and everybody else's respect in Music City Wrestling and that's a solemn oath and take it to the bank, Burt Prentice. Saturday, April 4th at the Nashville Fairgrounds Sports Arena. MCW presents the Tojo Yamamoto Memorial Card, a tribute to one of the greatest pioneers in professional wrestling. Help us celebrate the life of Tojo Yamamoto with Nashville's hottest wrestling lineup ever. The Tojo Yamamoto Memorial Card, Saturday, April 4th at the Nashville Fairgrounds Sports Arena. Well, tonight in Nashville, Tennessee, MCW Wrestling is having one of their biggest nights. It's the Tojo Yamamoto Memorial Show. And MCW, you know, in the first place, it stands for Music City Wrestling. And everyone around here seems to be really proud of the great tradition of MCW and the Nashville Fairgrounds where we're having that event tonight. And, you know, I'll be honest, when I used to sit up in New York and hear about all these legendary matches in the Nashville Fairgrounds, I kind of looked forward several months ago coming down here to be a part of this. But, you know, then I get here, and I see all the big heroes that are running around. And I see the typical fan that comes to the fairgrounds every Saturday night. And I realize that, you know, the typical 12-pack guzzling redneck that sits in the front row who's got to drink all that liquid courage before he'd even think about saying even the slightest thing to Flash Flanagan for fear that he'd come out and knock his gums right down his throat sits there and because they don't have the guts to do it themselves, has to live vicariously through little old school heroes like Wolfie D. Well, tonight in Nashville, Tennessee at the fairgrounds, Flash Flanagan and Wolfie D are going at it one more time. You know, Nashville, Tennessee, that's almost a new tradition around here, is for Flash Flanagan and Wolfie D to go at it. Month after month after month they've done it. They've hung each other off the rafters at the fairgrounds. They've had ladder matches. They've nearly killed each other. And it's been nonstop for months, right up until this past week in Lebanon, Tennessee, this past Sunday, this past Tuesday in Louisville. We did it one more time, and they brought it all over the building. That's what they're going to do tonight. Now, Wolfie D, I know you're coming there, and you're not 100%. You got a bad wheel because we took out one of your legs. Your head's all messed up because we took a chair to your head, and we proved that steel and flesh don't mix. So tonight, you want to come down and try it one more time and get in our way one more time and get in Flash's way one more time. You're going down for the last time because tonight, what's going to happen is Flash Flanagan, who's been the brightest shining star around here for months on end, beating you left and right night after night, is going to get that belt tonight in that Mangaromo. If we have to go through you, we don't care. We've done it a million times before, and now I'm here to see that it happens once more. And then once that's all done, 
You want to throw 19 other people? It doesn't matter because people sit there and they talk about Flash and they say he's not right in the head. Well, I heard a saying a long time ago. And you know, it talks about how you don't try to attack a goat from the front, a mule from behind, or a madman from any side. Well, Flash Flanagan, after months and months of dealing with Wolfie D and his little cult of fans, is a damn madman. And he's coming tonight to Nashville to take out Wolfie D once and for all and get that belt.